lesson of the Catechism to know, love, and serve God and be happy with Him forever. This is something that we find in the lives of many saints, is that they would reflect upon death and the ultimate end. In fact, saints had a mantra, memento mori, which is the Latin word for remember that we will die. And that, again, helps us to put things into perspective. It helps us to carry our crosses. And it reminds us that we ought to take advantage of these crosses and trials to sanctify ourselves, to earn merit by bearing them with our Lord who bore the cross. And I want to give another sermon on this later on in Lent, another topic. But that is how selfless our Lord was in his passion. Can you imagine the excessive pain and sorrow and suffering he, he experienced? And yet, what can he say when he met the women weeping on the way to Calvary? He ate the station. Weep not for me, but for yourselves and for your children. Utterly forgetful of himself. Again, when he's nailed up to the cross, what were his first words? Forgive them, Father. What was his second word on the cross? This day thou shalt be with me in paradise, to the good thief. So we see our Lord forgetful of himself, even in the midst of so much suffering. So this is something we should reflect upon. Start to imitate our Lord, to be selfless, to overcome, to strive to overcome that selfishness where we become, again, so worked up, perhaps, about little things that annoy us, that in the big scheme of things, when we think of death, when we think of eternity, are so little and insignificant. Let us strive, this time and always, to carry our crosses in the name of our Lord, who is forgetful of self and thinking only of others.